Northwestern administrators say they've been watching these protests pop up around the country and are now enacting what they call an interim policy for student demonstrations. CBS 2's Sarah Maki has been talking with some members of the Northwestern community watching this protest with big concern. Sarah? Yeah, the issue at hand here is that interim policy, which they say was announced just this morning, that prohibits things like tents and temporary structures, though you can see some tents remain out here right now today. Now we've been talking with some members of the Jewish community who tell us they're thinking about safety and security on campus, and they are asking administrators to enforce their own rules. A student-led protest drums up support for their cause, their numbers growing throughout the day. But along the edge of the property, some watch with questions or even concerns. The fact that you don't know who's who here is, is slightly unsettling. You don't have to scan in to get on the lawn or anything. It's a safety risk. Eden Macknin is here after at least one professor canceled class for the day, citing the protest telling students to take care of yourselves and each other. Talking with us about her concerns as the drumming draws near. Really overwhelmed. Honestly, I, I'm at a loss for words. I can't really help but stand here and just look and listen and observe what's going on. The sounds of the protests. <laughs> carrying over to neighboring Northwestern Hillel, a Jewish student organization. We weren't particularly surprised that it would be happening here. We, it was more of a question of when. Executive Director Michael Simon saying they've heard from their counterparts on other campuses about the protests there. But what's really important, especially on a college campus, is that that's done in an environment that is free of intimidation, threats or harassment. Jewish advocacy groups now watching what's happening in Evanston. The universities have codes of conduct. They have standards that need to be enforced. University staff told us, in part, students who refuse to remove their tents will be subject to arrest and their tents will be removed by the university. Community members who do not adhere to university policies will face discipline. Everyone we spoke with said that they support the students' right to protest and the right to free speech. They are just asking administrators make sure that it is all done safely for all and free of any intimidation. Live at Northwestern Saramaki, CBS2 News. Sarah, thank you.